Alright, buddy. I know it's going to be a little chilly, but, like, just hang on. It's going to be fine. Don't fall. This is really what the forklift was meant to do. Yo, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to another episode here on Sneaky Sasquatch. And in today's video, we are going to be trying to finish up the rest of the forklift port missions. Because... I still have not finished these, and I kind of want to unlock the forklift. I think it's like the final vehicle I have to unlock. So, let's head on over to the port and do that right now. I guess I could have probably picked a different vehicle other than a bike, but... Ah, eh, you know what? It's whatever. A little rain is good for you. Park our bike. I wish we had a garage or something, but that'll be fine. Run inside, and let's do some forklift missions. Alright, let's, uh, let's unload the ship. I, I, I prefer to unload the ship as opposed to loading it. Look at our clipboards. We need cables, warehouse B. Everything goes to warehouse B. Very nice when everything can go to the same place. I think we might have to do some reorganizing, though, because this place is looking a little messy. Pick these barrels up over here. Let's just put them on top of each other. place looks a little bit better now. We should be good. Be able to pick all this stuff up. I don't actually think we can stack these cables and stuff on top of each other, which is kind of annoying, but it's all right. Stack this over here with the other cable. See if we can't find something to put this on top of. Ah, uh, we can put it on top of this box right here. Look at that. Perfect. All the boxes are together now. Pick up this cable here. And we should be able to stick it on top of this crate. Then we can take the crate and make one less trip. We could have been really efficient there, I guess, and stuck it on top of the dynamite, but that's all right. We need to stack this dynamite here on top of the other dynamite. Oh, come on. Pick it up. Drop it right there, man. Look at him go. All right, we've got about, I think, two more to do. Or is it three more? Two or three more to do before we can actually fully unlock the forklift. And I believe then we do actually get the forklift itself. I could be wrong about that because I'm not an expert on this stuff. Oh, we're supposed to load the ship. Oh, whoops. That's my bad. All right, where's the barbecue sauce at? Way in the back. There we go. There's one. There we go. There we go. See, it's all part of a plan. All right, drop this off. So now we need two copper. I think it's a copper. I believe it's copper we need. We need two of these, I know. All right, and now we need three paper. I think we can only do two at a time, though. Final paper. There we go. Take this on over here. And that should finish it out. There we go. Yeah, so I think it's going to be two more missions we got to do. No, you ain't got to. It's all right. You ain't got to open the door. We could have done it ourselves. This is just like old times, back in the old city update. Or when the town update came out. Every night, you go, or every day you go to work, and then you come back to the apartment and go to sleep. And then you'd wake up and you'd do it again. Some of the most fun I remember having playing Sneaky Sasquatch was running around the campsites looking for food. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. But those were some of the, my favorite memories of Sneaky Sasquatch, is running around, looking for food in the campsites, hiding in bushes, and then finding... I think finding the treasure map was probably the most fun I had in Sneaky Sasquatch. When I think of Sneaky Sasquatch, that's what I think of. All right, we're back here at the port. Let's do some more. I think they should have some more forklift jobs for today. Would be nice. Sweet, we got three. Nice. Well, let's load the ship. And then we'll, uh, we'll do the rest. Alright, we need warehouse C. Oh, everything's from warehouse C. So we need four pulp, two coal, and one copper. Actually, where's everything going? I just now realized that'd probably be a good thing to do. Ah, uh, berth two. Nice. It's always a good thing to know where everything is going to go. We know we need two coal. So let's take this down there real quick. Oh, that's the door. Whoa. Don't need wood. Oh, you can't put pulp on top of pulp? I thought you could. Well, that's kind of sad. We just gotta make a bunch of loads of pulp then. One more thing of pulp, and then we just need the copper. Actually, I think we can stick this on top of there, can't we? There we go, yes we can. Now can we pick, yes we can pick it up. And that is it for loading the ship, I do believe. Yes it is, 450, I think we need one more. One more and we should be able to unlock this forklift that we're after. I'm hoping at least. And if not, we'll do something else. And everything goes to warehouse B. Nice. Where do we stick all this? Just doing a little reorganizing, you know. Everything's fine. Now we're good. Now we can do some unloading. Actually, if he drops this, we might be able to just go ahead and stick this on top of the steel as well. Oh, we can pick it all up. Look at that. 
That's cool. That's a big load, I'm not gonna lie to you. Takes a little bit to fit through the door. Wow, we are really bad at this. Four more to go, we're halfway there. Final two things. We'll just uh, stick that right there. And the final thing, before we can get our beautiful forklift, at least I do believe, is this spool of cable. There we go. 640 coins, and we should have unlocked our forklift. I keep wanting to say skid steer, but it's not a skid steer. It's a forklift. Oh, what is this? I need to speak with you for with you for a moment. Everyone here is totally blown away by your for forklift skills. We've never seen anything like it. The other drivers all chipped in and bought you a little present. Here it comes. Yes! Yes! We got ourselves a forklift. That's what I'm talking about. Hope you like it. I freaking love it. I'm not sure why they thought you would want that, but it was really nice of them. You can keep it parked here free for free of charge. That's my part of the present. Whew, I'm exhausted. I really need to hire a junior supervisor. If only I could find someone with enough experience. A qualified candidate would need to have a lot of hands-on experience in all the jobs around here. Oh well, I'd better get back to keep back to it. Keep up the good work. Wait a sec. I didn't actually know you need you could become a junior supervisor. I didn't even know that was a thing. That's kind of cool. Oh well, we got ourselves a forklift. That's all that matters. Well, let's go upgrade the forklift. That's all I care about. Is it really? Actually, are we really going to have to drive it all the way there? Or should I just teleport? Ah, there it is. It's sitting right there. Perfect. All right, let's jump in this thing and go. Yeah, I've never, like, I've seen loads of videos of people, like, stealing from the port, stealing crates from the port. Like, but I've never done it because I've never had the skid steer or the forklift. They had gum and it's a forklift, not a skid steer. Run over here. The garage. See if we can't. What is it? Is that a forklift? I don't know how to upgrade that. We can make it green. Oh, we can make a green forklift. Look at that. Well, let's go in here then. I don't really want the bow tie. Bow tie looks kind of. Oh, we can get a dual exhaust. We can get a hood vent. Oh my goodness. Can we actually get police lights? That's hilarious. We can get a roof rack. Oh, yes. Obviously, we need that. Nah, it can be yellow. Oh man, that's beautiful. What else can we do? Special custom suspension. Yes. Oh my goodness. Big tires. Well, this is great. Well, now we got to do something with the tires, obviously. We got to get some uh blue sticky tires. Now we obviously are going to need some rims. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Put those on. Ah, uh, we'll give them a little gray. Oh, yes. This is easily the greatest forklift ever. Look at the way it rocks. Oh, my goodness. Wait, can we give someone a ride? Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, my goodness. We're going to give him a ride to the ski resort. Oh, my goodness. This poor guy. Here, you get, here we'll, we'll put him up high. <laughs> oh my goodness he's way up there all right buddy I know it's gonna be a little chilly but like just hang on it's gonna be fine don't fall nice day out today huh yeah sure is nice day to be just chilling on a fork what a smooth ride yeah, it's really not bad is it it takes a long time to get to the ski resort with a forklift I'm not gonna lie to you he only gave me Three stars. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ranger's coming after us. Woohoo! Wait, what happens if we take it on ice? This is really what the forklift was meant to do. This is what they definitely intended for it to do. Sasquatch, it's time to go home. Enough playing. Let's get out of here. Let's go on. Ah, uh, it's a stump. Wait, can we run over that? Nope. Definitely can't run over the stump. That's kind of sad. We got big tires and we can't even run over stuff. All right, Sasquatch, time to go home. Let's go. Now we got to drive all the way back home. Wow, this is not going to be a long ride at all.